hello and welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new it's target thursday lots of clearance and all things valentine's day at the dollar spot are you ready let's shop starting off at the dollar spot the dollar spot has been hitting last week and this week lots of new items starting off with this little lacy susan right here super cute three dollars then these are the spray bottles we saw last week three dollars each and then spray bottle set these are smaller these are like the spritz kind of bottles very very cute they come with the labels i don't remember if last week i mentioned that the other bottles right next to these the bigger ones they also come with the little label stickers which is very very nice then they also have these planters this these are um plastic as you can see and then this was my favorite in this section right here the boot tray for five dollars what and it's a very nice size too they also have it in black they're doing a lot with the whole like uh i don't know that this is a hunter green what kind of green is this what is that velvet what kind of green is that <laughs> seriously but it's a very good green then they also have brand new this week these book ends the very first one i showed you is my favorite now this marble looking one of course is not real looks really nice too but they are heavy even though there's not like real stone they are very nice and heavy then we have storage of course spring cleaning what is it called spring rain brings what is the saying spring cleaning brings something please tell me in the comments below what i'm trying to think of there's some kind of saying about spring cleaning isn't there i'm pretty sure pretty pretty sure okay but they have all the things organizational and spring cleaning and all the things five dollars for these baskets i thought these were nice the handles are like kind of springy so that was cute then they have a few things for New Year's, which is coming up this weekend. Happy New Year. Are you guys doing anything for New Year's? Let me know. Are you guys going to parties? Do you celebrate any kind of way, different or traditional or, you know, let me know. But I myself will be staying home as usual. Now look at this. This is what this does. It's like a little disco ball. So that was cute. And then they have these little, um, i was gonna say favors but they're like blow horns type things for three dollars so that's not bad at all new the baskets these are little mesh baskets in white with the gold handles these are nice i like these five dollars each i thought maybe they were maybe different sizes so i kind of pulled these out just to make sure they're all the same size they have so many of them again organizational vibes and just you know new all things new for the new year kind of situation look at these so these are turn tables if you can call them that or like turn they're not like lacy susans they're not like the ones from last year remember last year these had like a a bottom where you could kind of turn it like a lazy susan well these didn't seem to have that or maybe it was just the one i grabbed now i'm not sure either way these seem to be better than the ones from last season now here are the three dollar candles that i'm not a huge fan of but i love the little jar that they're in and lots of different scents as you can see i hope you were able to see some of those scents the smell is so so i really truly don't think that like the candles from the dollar spot are worth it in my opinion just because for five dollars you could get a much bigger substantial candle in the regular section that probably has a way better lasting power and just like a better throw and everything here is more spring three dollars for these little like makeup sponges situations reusable makeup remover i wasn't sure if maybe these two packages were the same see how one has like a little mesh bag but the other one didn't so there's that fend for yourselves on that one <laughs> lots of new items for like you know 
like that makeup and just uh, starting a new regimen like exercise and things like that. Now these little garlands right here are super cute. This green one is my favorite. These are five. Kind of feel like they should be three dollars, but I don't make up the prices. Three dollars for these. These are cute. Of course, I always feel like the yellow that they do for the items in the dollar spot is a little too yellow, but this one's actually not that bad. It's actually better than some other gold. Did I say gold? Did I say something else? I'm not even sure what I said, but we're talking about the gold. The gold can be a little too yellow. This one is actually a little bit better than in the past. Now look at this to go with the planters that they have. $5 for this really nice plant stand and you could use it either way. I was trying to show you the picture like you could either use it like this or like this. Very versatile and it's actually pretty big. Now here are the babies two for five dollars of this bigger one right here that we saw last week. So the babies are in now. And then they also have these wooden spatulas, wooden spoons and such. I was trying to see like, are there different ones? And they are like, one is like slanted. This one is just straight at the top there. These are all $3 wooden utensils. That's the official name. And then some of these items we saw last week, the colanders are here. I have one from last year possibly two years ago. I think it's from last year. Love the green. Like I was saying before, you see they're doing lots of that green. And then another new item this week, the butter dish. How nice is this? For the dollar spot, $3 for a butter dish. And it feels really nice. It was really, really nice. Who uses a butter dish? I feel like that's such a controversial thing. I've grew up with our butter on the counter on a butter dish. Let me know in the comments if you do the same or if you're like, uh, absolutely not. The butter needs to be in the fridge, you know? Let me know. That's, I feel like that's like, there's like, it's like 50 50 most of the time. I would love to see what you guys do. Now, here's this little juicer guy. I love this item. I love it. The clear glass, love, $3. We saw that one last week. What we didn't see last week is this little plant stand. It's a pack of two for five. These are so cute. Love those. More baskets. Now these have the little liner in them. $5 for the round. $5 for the square too. And then look at what I found this week. The bread box. I told you guys last week that there is a green one. I've seen it before on like Instagram and such. Well, this week they have both. Like my store was so much more organized this week and everything was like in its proper place. Very, very nice. I was very happy with how the dollar spot looked this week. Now look at those bottles. That's all part of, you know, new year, new me, exercise and all the things. Here are some ankle weights as well. They are nice. Like this, these items are really really nice for it being as inexpensive as they are like i feel like they're not just throwaways like you could actually truly use them here are the valentine's day socks very cute they're two dollars this year y'all remember these used to be a dollar they're two dollars this year there's that water bottle again in that beautiful color kind of like a um turquoise kind of color and then these jars i couldn't figure out why please tell me if you know why do these jars have the string why do they have the string i couldn't figure it out i'm not i mean and it has the little spoon it's cute but what's this string about so then this little set of drawers very nice they felt really nice and sturdy but they only had the one in my store. So I'm sure maybe they're going to be stocking more of those. This love sign is new this week. Very cute. This is another item. Look, look at how big it is. It's not that big. It's not that big. I specifically wanted to show you that because that's another item I've seen on like Instagram. And I thought that that sign was way bigger and it's not, it's just like a little bit bigger than my hand, you know? So just be aware of that. I feel like sometimes 
pictures and even in the videos, like things look larger than they really are and possibly maybe sometimes smaller than they really are. So sometimes I like to point out the sizes of the items. Now, this little pack is really cute. I love it. $5, you get two mugs. Super cute. Love that. And then these, at first I was like, what are these? What is that velvet? What are these? But they're snack bowls and you get three and the little stand. Super cute. Oh boy, here are these jars. These are still here. I'm very surprised. I would have thought that by now, a week later, they would be all gone. Maybe they restocked. That's a possibility. But those jars were definitely, they're really cute and they're definitely going to sell out. Now here's these. How cute are these? five dollars you know i love a little box situation like i don't know what it is about these but i love them usually when um uh, michaels has them you guys know if you've been watching a while i've purchased those before for like christmas time and so i have several of those but look they have these like baby ones for valentine's day super cute now look at this three dollars for this little sweet you kind of can make like a little sweet shop type vibes or like oh a tear tray these are good for a tear tray i asked you i i asked you guys this like a while back are we still doing tear trays i haven't done a tear tray in like two years now how do we feel about those i mean if you're still doing them that's great no you know Everybody needs to do what they wish. I just have gone away from it. I don't know why, but then sometimes I see items like this and I'm like, oh, tear tray time. How cute is this plate? Love, $3 for the bigger plate. The other one is a set of two, a little bit smaller. Please stay. I mean, my store is completely overstocked on those little, you know, wagon. What are those exactly? Like, you know what I'm talking about, the gumball looking jar that's right there. Those little ramekins, those heart ramekins, super cute. While I was in the store, people were grabbing those up. So if you like those, get them because they apparently are very, very popular. These little tins I love. This one is my favorite, of course. Very neutral with the heart. So, so cute. Love those. And then they also have this little tray in a heart shape for five. You see the ramekins on the side there? I'm telling you, grab those up for sure. Here's what they have for Christmas clearance, 50% off. We are going to see some clearance at the very end, so stay tuned for that. I should have probably told you that sooner. <laughs> Speaking of tear trays, here are these little sets. See what I mean? Like they just make the cutest little things that it makes you want to do a tear tray. $3, you get three little items, super cute. We saw those gnomes last week. Also the mailboxes, these signs as well. This one though, I kind of love that one. That one is really good. Some buckets, again, organizational stuff. And then my favorite, tic-tac-toe. I love it when they do these. They gave us two colorways, the all neutral and then the natural wood with the red love one dollar headband for valentine's day these clips are so cute love lots of glitter but super cute also for a dollar and then the little heart-shaped sunglasses those are also a dollar and look at these little ducks. These are a dollar and they're adorable. So cute. They have so many cute items for Valentine's Day for the kids. Really, really good stuff. $3 for these right here. Like how adorable is this? It comes with the pen and everything. A little notepad. So super cute. Then they have these little plushies. Look at the frog. So good. A little clip. These are $2. And then we saw these last week. Those are $3. They're super cute. Look at those. What kid would not want that? I mean, I, I'm an adult and I want one. <laughs> these pens are everything. $2 for these. 
again, so many good things for the kids. Like this is so nice. I love these. They're very substantial for $2, you know? Look at the sloth and the glitter. This one has everything going. Super cute for $2. These are items that the kids can give out in school if they do that, you know? Or you could just have it for yourself at your desk. Why not? A little bit of Easter, $5 for these Easter baskets. Very cute. So they're already bringing the Easter. By next week, we're probably going to see like half of the dollar spot be Easter items. Okay, when I saw this, I was like, oh, I have to show you guys this. So this is like, I guess, the new version of like, remember, what was that called? You guys know what I'm talking about. These are $3, but you know what I'm talking about when we used to fold up the papers. Let's go back to our childhood a little bit. <laughs> we used to fold the papers and write the things, and then you like did it with your friends, and they had to pick a number, and then you flipped it again, and then it would unfold something. And who knows what I'm talking about? Let me know in the comments, please, because I can't be the only one. But that's what that reminded me of. And I think it's just like the new version of these things. And you just don't have to make it yourself anymore. Now these, the play broom and mop, love. I love them. So, so good. Now here we are at our favorite spot. 50% off all Christmas items. This doesn't say Christmas though. So $35 original price, now 50% off. You can get this tray, the basket, the Noel sign. And the other sign there, the Merry Christmas, those are were originally 25 Now they're 50% off. Now it's the time to get them. And then my store did not have like the greatest selection. I'm seeing things on the internet that is like some stores just have like full aisles still of so many choices. Mine did not. So I decided to just show you like what's left and just go through it very quickly um some areas are super picked over you're going to see like when we go to the back it's really really not the greatest of choices but hearth and hand i felt had some kind of somewhat good things right here all of the kitchen items the cookie um what are those called by the way those stamps Remember I told you guys that those stamps were going to end up in clearance? Well, here they are. They're in clearance. The mugs, clearance. Like, and these are nice. I love the green. So just saying, some of the kids' toys, clearance, 50% off right now. But do you see? Do you see what's over here? They were putting out all the new collection. I know the new collection is available already online, but it's not yet at my store. But as you can see, they were working very hard at putting it out. So next week's video, stay tuned. We're going to see all the new spring Hearth and Hand and probably Studio McGee as well. In the meantime, here's Hearth and Hand uh, clearance, Christmas clearance, if you will. Lots of candles left. The wreath um, diffusers, wreaths, wreaths. You guys know I can never say that. <laughs> these uh trees plants if you will are actually really nice i like this bottom one a lot better but it's also more expensive at 13.99 but still cheaper than the original so that's not horrific now here's what the back of my store looks like seven dollar bins ten dollar bins put away all your christmas type situations going on here's a little bit of like the candy the food and such cookies for santa 30 percent off on these items and then the rest of like Christmas stuff is still, like I said, 50% off even back here in this section. Look at how my store looks. There's like nothing left. These are the few stockings that were left. I just figured I'd peruse and show you a little bit, kind of point out the better items that are still left. Let me know if your store looks like mine or if your store is more like still has aisles of really good items left. A lot of these little like icicle lights, these are now five. Not a bad uh, price for those. That's a good purchase to put away, tuck away for next year. I know for a fact next year I'm going to need lots of lights. Like, look at how picked over all this stuff is. Like, 
it's not the greatest. And I'm actually surprised. A lot of the times my store has very good after Christmas clearance for my Target store. And this year it just wasn't the greatest. Here's a couple of um, stockings, not stockings, <laughs> tree skirts, originally $15. Now they're 50% off. And then they have the black and white one right there. Just very random things. And then also some of the gift wrapping items. Now, this is a very good thing to get at this point because that's, this is, I've told you guys many times before, this is when I like to get wrapping paper. And some of this wrapping paper is actually not just Christmas. Like that one right there, the Disney, not so much Christmas. So sometimes you can even score items that are on sale because of Christmas, but they don't necessarily say Christmas so you can use them throughout the year. So that's a good idea. Like look at this one, Raya, Raya from Disney. I'm not sure. I'm never sure how to say that one, but it's a good movie. I love that one. And it's good uh, wrapping paper just throughout the year for kids' birthdays and such. So keep that in mind. This little guy right here, I'm like, is this a game? What is this? And it's just a box. It's just a, a, a gift box. <laughs> but I was very interested because I'm like, oh, it's Noche Buena. Like, oh, do I need this? Is this a game? What's going on? But um, they also had that pack of present um, labels. That's the word. <laughs> Tags, if you will. Now, those stocking holders are really pretty. I'm surprised they had so many left. But if you love them you're, you know, you're in luck because those are really, really cute. The Noel sign, I thought that was really nice. I really like that. And then here's again, the icicle lights. And then some of these black houses, again, not so much Christmas necessarily. And that is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. Let's keep the party going by clicking on one of the videos right here on the screen. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.